What's good, Homo Squad? It's your boy, Homo Ziggy, and we back here with another music mayhem for y'all. And hey, we got a good list right here for y'all. We got like if I'm, yeah, five songs here. So hey, you already know. Make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe, comment down below which one of these songs are your favorite and such. And hey, we just gonna start it off with the Wolf Dead. Daniel rap move from a uh, hold on y'all sorry about that is this you find an enemy called lookism 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 i don't know but hold on but either way we better check this out like i said you can see all my socials up there so without further ado let's get in the video Give it a sec, cause I don't know why this always happens. Oh no no no, let me start this off. Hold on, let's pause for a second, right? Cause I don't know, y'all yeah, look. I don't know why this always happens whenever it comes to my OBS. It just always like, well, not for my OBS. Anytime when I even use my laptop for OBS, it just suddenly wants to trip out like that. I don't know why, but let's get into the song. Hey. 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 It's just something when it comes to that black magic. What can I say? It's that melanin, man. Hey, all women can, all women are saucy, right? Don't get it twisted. But I'm just saying, when it's that melanin, that melanin, it just has a whole nother different level of saucy. You cannot deny that. It's okay. okay. I'ma tell it to you plain. I ain't here for the games. I just simply elevate. I don't mm. need that fake love. I can't catch it at the bank. I can't mm. eat that like a way. I can't eat that on my plate. All mm. the GMO states got you posing like something that you ain't. Oh my god, mm. like something that you ain't. Let me say, I know y'all looking for escape, but I can't percolate. Yeah, I meet every day. Bitch, mm. move. Better move, better move. Wasn't feeling me now. They trying to be the crew. Better mm. move. Nah, nah, bring it back, bring it back. Nah, you crazy. The wolf, this is the wolf. I gotta say this with the wolf, she's a life for the shower. When did, did they ever make a song together? Pretty sure they did. But either way, right? With the wolf and frivolous shower, I wish them two would be a, make an album together. Straight up, them two make a collab album together because I feel with the level of sauciness those two have, it will be crazy. But go back to the <laughs> I 
I can eat it on my plate. Like Better move. Better move. Hey, better move. Hey, better move. Better move. Hey, shout out to the wolf with the sauciness, girl. Keep on doing what you're doing. I think I'm gonna come back to you more often. Straight up, cause girl, you be coming with different levels of sauciness that honestly, I be forget. Straight up with you. I be forgetting you can come with that sauciness. Hold on, y'all. Give me a second. All right, sorry about that. Little technical problems, but yeah, like I was saying with the wolf, she comes with that sauciness and hey, girl, my bath and never. I'm gonna make sure I keep coming to you because I be because trust me, ever since when you did that nerd control response and such, girl. You, you already were saucy enough, but with that response, I'm just saying, girl, you're on a different level. But hey, shout out to the wolf. But now we got Mr. Aizen Senpai. Welcome to the Vibe Society. Aizen featuring 954 Mari Decay. Let's get it. What you got for us? Take your hero back, he saved me one time My hero, where you at? Cause I'm not on high Yeah, that's it, take another second, take another break Oh no, you ain't learned your lesson, homie, yeah You gon' hold this L, you ain't lived the life I live You ain't never been through hell It ain't never been handed to me So just hand it to me, I want it all for me one for all, more like all for me mm. Little brother, you belong with me I'ma make you feel it Feel it Dying from, from the inside out Dying from the inside out Bet they gon' feel it When they dying from the inside Damn it, I wish I had my shades right now God damn it If, if they feel like this If if I, if it wasn't for my situation, right, that's going on right now, if it wasn't for my situation, I should have picked up my goddamn shades if any how I'm going to react to more Ice and Senpai, because goddamn it, dude, you be, I, y'all, when it comes to me, right, my apologies, y'all, I be telling y'all, I be messing up when it comes to reacting to my nerdcore artists, because with, like I said, with everything that's going on, per, like in my personal life and such, trust me, I be forgetting some of these nerdcore songs be so relaxing to me. Not gonna lie. Especially eyes and. Alright, Mari, what you got for us? Save your pity, better save your cap and said he ain't safe, you just saving status Black the masses, then their attack is making monsters out of us, that's a fatal habit I don't want to vote confidence in the false idols of the fake facets Looked over by the gov, now I elect the governor with state of madness I've been feeling so depressed by the world and they tell me that I'm ill in the head Your city is a sick canvas, so why they pay me as a villain instead? Crazy how I sw- What'd I say? what I keep on telling y'all? This nigga Mari is gangster poetry at its finest Hold up Run that back. What you say to me? Then they tell me that I'm ill in the head. Your city is a sick canvas. So why they pay me as a villain instead? Crazy how I sway to the evil side, making waves with the fangs of death. I'm king of the next. They love me, so I fill them with dread. I'm make them feel it. Dying from the inside. Dying from the inside. 
好难呀，好难，我得黑开冰箱。Now we gotta pause this. We gotta pause this. Hold on, let me wait till my laptop readjust itself. I don't know why this always happens. I promise to y'all, this this is, and I don't know why this always happens. I honest to God. Hold on, give me a second again, y'all. Sorry about that again. This why this why most of the times I don't like reacting with OBS because it makes my laptop trip out, and I don't know why. But besides that. Bro, Mari, if you see this, my dude, you is a beast. When I be telling y'all, Mari, Mari is like how Rusted would be if he if Rusted was more like Hoodish, I would say, because more in a way you can say more in a more you know a little bit more blackish, you would say, but. I'm just saying, Mari comes with so many freaking. In a way, he's like how Zach B is, but the but with Zach B, it's more of a conscious. But with Mari, it's it's poetry, hood poetry, right, bro? I've been feeling so depressed by the world, and they tell me that I'm ill in the head. City is a sick canvas, so why they paint me as a villain? Crazy how I sway to the evil side, making way. Eisen. Myself, I was left abandoned. The ones that you defended really try to take me out. I'ma talk to them in the way they understand me. Violence is the only way these motherfuckers hit me. I ain't never had a family with these powers. Could you teach me? I y'all already know what I tell you, especially when it comes to Isaac. This nigga knows I'm a sucker for. It's basically like this: if if you're a black man like me, or just anybody who knows good singing when you hear it. You know, whenever you hear them high freaking notes, it gonna make you react. Nigga, maybe had to freaking fix up my pillow and shit. Talk to them in the way they understand me. Violence is the only way these motherfuckers hate me. Oh, I ain't never had a family. Oh, 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 oh. These powers could you teach me oh, oh, oh. to stop anybody against me? Oh, oh, oh. I will make them feel. Inside, inside, they gon' feel me. When they die from the inside, die from the inside, die from the inside. God damn it, Eisen! God damn it, me for not keep on reacting to Eisen. What the heck is wrong with me? Eisen, hold on. Before we get into, hold on, 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 hold on. I cook up shit with my friends. Who better with me to travel the land? Hold on, back up, back up. Hold on. Before we get into this next one, man, fucking Eisen, I miss reacting to you, bro. Straight up, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know. I don't know why is it me with eyes when I don't react to Aiden. I don't know why. Cause this, I need to remember. I gotta remind myself. This is the nigga who has some of my one of my best songs in Sludge, Sludge, Such, which is 
this night, most of my songs I love from Icing is flashy, freaking. I don't need friends. Black Flash, freaking uh, uh um, imposter, and now freaking this one. There's probably more in search, but god dang it, Isaac, you did you, man, you was um, I'm just saying. Ever since when you got, you blew up. I know you've been doing this for a long time, Isaac, but my dude, I'm just saying. From the minute you were picked up by Rustish, right? That's what how I say. I know y'all probably got your opinions. Hey, hold on, let me talk to y'all for a second. I know that y'all probably got your opinions, right? And hey, y'all could be right, right? But hear me, hear me when I say this. I feel like ever since when Eisen got got on a feature, basically got on a song with Rustage on Rustage's song, the Tenjin, the Tenjin Uzi one with the CD lights. Tell me, y'all. Tell me from when you heard that song and you hear the chorus from Isaac that people were stick to this guy. Like, who the heck is this guy? Tell me, y'all didn't feel like that, cause nigga, with Isaac, I'm just saying from late last, from last year and such, he just brings in a new element to nerdcore. Tell me I'm wrong, cause like I said, I know he's done. He's been doing this for a long time, right? I know that. But I'm just saying. It just get, you just got to find that right, either right song or just that right position for you to make people be like, who the heck is this guy? This guy is something different. And hey, I'm not going to lie to y'all. From last year to now, as in, Keep on doing what you're doing, my boy, because trust me, you need to make it big, straight up. But hey, 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 Mari too, my dude, Mari, you is a monster. But either way, let's get into this now. Sanji Rap, Alfredo, Black Diamonds, Jamal Rose, and Delta D's. Let's get it. They want to RP from me, they should pay in advance. I cook up shit with my friends. Who better with me to travel the land? I got to cook up, so sorry, my nigga. I'm never going to fight with my hands. I'm in that hockey so cold. We hitting all angles. I'm kicking through sand. I'm in the back room rolling up 10. I'm roasting the pack through. We don't do Zans. I'm kicking it blast through. All of they plaques through. None of my niggas are seeing the can. Smoking the rooms like Tony Montana. I'm kicking hey. the doors. They throwing up hands. I need the berries. This shit is sunny. Used to be merry. Cherry kicks. Used to no spare. Yeah, I be shooting shits with a drink in my hand. I'm in the kitchen just doing my dance Short slick dude got sauce in my pants It's stuff in my waist, cook all type fuck boys I just go to the kitchen to cut noise I'm with a hot girl driving a bowl I lose control if I hop in the door Why is it that whenever I hear a Black Diamond song The beat I always tell y'all Whenever it comes to me and hearing songs right? No matter what the genre is it Nerdcore, mainstream, whatever It's always the beat Right the minute if I hear the beat and it automatically catches me, right? I'm gonna be intrigued. But then when the lyrics start to come on, right? And it flows so perfectly with the beat, automatically I'm like intrigued and it makes me connect instantly. That's how I feel every single time when I come to a Black Diamond song. Almost every single song. There are certain songs that are a hit and miss with me. But it's just something about when they ate, especially when it's the 808s. Because like this, the beat is just booming in the background. And then when the flow's on this, it's crazy. This not a hold up. You said this not an army chip or this is an army chip. Hold up. Watch now, army chip. That's how the wrist will roll. Delta. Hey yo. 
really <laughs> let me see hold on i know this for a fact that delta made this amv hold on yeah freaking delta you gonna really put delta i mean not delta black diamonds nick really black you gonna really put saint noise this nigga here <laughs> you stupid saint noise for this The more Charlie look up at the moon, did she evil? Something about it, she changing the tempo. Hop on the dick, trust she never been simple. Uh, wait, get with the plan. I want the bins and I grind till it's all been using my hands when you hit with the one, two. Always been cooking, I'm making that soul food. Uh, what the kitchen, a place. What you know about soul food, nigga? Well, he, hey, if you a bad person, you already know that soul food is good. Been cooking, I'm making that soul food. What? The kitchen, a place where I feel most alive. You play with the crew, better trust you get fried. We've been cooking since it started to ride. You see the steam start to rise. Hey, that's just the class from the blunt that I smoke. Ever Ooh. since birth, I've been known as a joke. But now mm -hmm. we've been up and they never gonna know that we move for a goal that they struggle to see. My team on the side, but they trust all of me. Now hey. we got Barry bounties by the size of the grand line. Step to the boy, then I blow like a landmine. Hey. Trust if it's up, then it's up. They give a price and I double it up. Kick up the strength of the drink in my cup. Get them curved stop, they was never enough. Hey. She gave me that ah, uh, bro. This is this is forget sauciness. This is fiery, cause nigga, the, I I be telling y'all with Delta, this man is gonna make a either a verse or a hook be just stuck in your head. The same way how I said about hold on, who I said it about again? Uh, freaking. Eisen, right? Same thing where I said about I no, same thing I said about sleep too, right? Bro, Delta this is what I be saying. I feel like this is what the thing with Otaku Underworld is, right? They're the type of sorry. Music gotcha bitch. Sorry, that was a flag coming towards me. But like I was gonna say, Otaku Underworld is the type of group where each artist are gonna find a way how to make a song, no matter if it's no matter if it's the lyrics, if it's the chorus, or if it's even the melody of the song itself, it's gonna stuck in your head. And I promise you, in in how music is today, trust me. If you basically this is how I this is how I feel like music are. When there's like four there's like four levels to it. The lyrics, the beat. The melody and the flow, right? Like whenever they do in their lyrics, they do it in a certain flow, right? If you get one of the four, hold on, I mean, to me, if you get two out of four or even three out of four, right? It's a banger. But if you get all four, Nigga, that is playlist on your Spotify, on iTunes, on whatever freaking music app you have. Whether you have to download it from where Pandora has this feature with Pandora, Pandora Premium, where once you like a song, you can download it. Trust me, songs like these, if they were ever played on Pandora, they will be downloaded immediately. Cause nigga, you need to tell me that if you're, if you're, Say if you got a car in search and you hear a song like this, you don't, especially with the eight of ways, you don't want that booming in your music. Cause I guarantee you this, if I had a car, I guarantee you this, that's, if anyhow this song comes up or any song for that matter from Nerdcore comes up and it has that saucy vibe about it, I'm telling you this, that song is gonna be going stupid with the bass on my car. <laughs> That wouldn't, my car won't be vibrating as hell, cause, but, but still, I'm just saying, that's how a toggle on the world is. They just got that music where it's gonna stick in your head and make you just be saucy and fiery at the same time. But they never gonna know that we move for a goal that they struggle to see. My team and one more word too, don't get it twisted. Now we got Barry Bounties by the size of the Grand Line. Step to the board, then I blow like a landmine. Trust if it's up, then it's up. They give a price and I double it up. Uh, Kick off the strength of the drink in my cup. Yeah. Let them curve stop, they was never enough. Uh, How could I sell? I make them walk with a limb. Yeah. Show y'all tall like a film. She give me the uh. And if she do it right, she get that Alfredo shrimp. I definitely mm. head first doing the light work, baby. I'm all in. 
Hey. Hey, Already. You'd already know. Playlist material, that's for damn sure. Who we got next? I'm telling you, playlist material. And if you don't agree with me, get out of here. Next out. Get out. We got now Hastic featuring Dave D with a Vegeta rap Prince. And I gotta say, I feel if I don't look, I know that um freaking Slick has mentioned Hastic saying especially Hastic and all that. Bro, I'm just saying. You know what? I don't care. It is what it is. Until when I hear from Hastic himself saying that he ain't in it, he will talk a word to me to the end. Straight up. But let's get into it. Remember them down days, nigga, I'm up now. Mm. I done put a few egos that I had to cut down. Mm. I done got in my bag, 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 bag. When I stop at this flash, 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 flash. Got a flash, nigga. Living that good life. We can have some all right. The last real nigga living, I ain't never ever ever gonna give it up tight. Gotta tell my wife I love her, get me ready for a good fight. Dang that I see my nose, it's gonna be a good night. Cause that means praying on my dog. Hey, what can I say? It's like this. For most niggas, most niggas won't like this. Especially for some hood niggas or whatever. Look here. I'm going to say it like this. For me, I'm going to be real as I can be. I don't give up what people say. I always live by this when it comes to music. As long as it has a good mellow, I mean like a good flow to a song, a good beat, and lyrics that are fire, and it actually has some substance in there. Like, we're not, not only just good lyrics, but good some substance in the lyrics, like what the lyrics are talking about, pertaining, pertaining to the song, no matter if it's nerd or mainstream or whatever. If it has that, don't matter what. Hold on, let me make me make me make myself big for y'all, cause I know some of y'all be saying, "Oh, is it?" And you just always talking. And look here, at the end of the day, when it comes to me, music, no matter what it is, no matter what kind it is, music to me, as long as it got that good vibe about it, whether it the, whether it's the lit vibe, whether it's that conscious vibe. Whether it's like the saucy vibe, no matter what it is. Hell, even the Caribbean vibe for that matter, right? No matter what it is, me, myself, if it sounds good to me, because I can give a dick. Because I know people always, when they want to hear music on their own, they just want to, they, they say it's fire, right? For me personally, 
me personally i don't care what anybody else say i ain't gonna be no yes man yes man no man because i don't give a damn it's basically like this i'm not gonna be one of those yes men and such saying that just because when just because you're an artist and even though my, I associate with you and such, not just on a music level, just on a personal level, right? I don't give a damn how much money you would want to pay me, right? You can pay me the whole entire money in the world, right? When it comes to this music, right? If you want people to have a good earworm, right? Good earworm to the music. And if I hear the beat, the beat can be one thing. But if I hear the lyrics you have and the flow you have on the song and it's trash, I'm telling you straight up with it. If it's trash, it's trash. I don't give a damn if I hurt your feelings because it's basically like this. You got a lot of, especially in the music industry, you got a lot of yes men, no, you got a lot of yes men saying that, oh, this shit fire when nine times out of ten, that shit ass. You cannot tell me otherwise. Think about it. How many mainstream songs you know that even though they say, oh, this shit fire, this shit gonna be hot, everybody gonna remember this. Then that's a, and then when you see later on, that shit gets like only like, saying like this, right? You post a song like today, right? I know I'm, a, I know this is a long reaction, but I don't care. You post a song, right? Today. And sooner, and then, and basically like this, a year ago, short, long story short, right? Because you know how the music industry is with the billboard and whatever and such. A year go by, right? You dropped a song this year, right? April. This year, right? Next year in April, that song you have that you dropped where you thought, oh, this is going to be fire. Everybody's going everybody to always listen to this and always want to get hyped. That shit only got 10,000 views. When a song like freaking DPS, freaking Slick, Mix Williams, D basically anybody in Nerdcore, right, who could have songs like this, who get freaking 100K views in a freaking week. And them shits be more fire and just be more entertaining than most songs in the mainstream. Straight up. And for goodness sakes, you want an example? DPS's death song, that shit hit on the top billboards. Hell, on even on his TikTok, his Ragnarok with him featuring McGuire, that shit had, if I'm not mistaken, it said like a million streams or copies or whatever. Nigga, if a song like that, if his songs like that can go big as hell, Nigga, what makes you think your song as a mainstream artist is ever... I don't care even if you're not a mainstream or you're just an underground. Look, I know this is a long rant. The point is, don't go hyping your music saying that, oh, you're the... Don't go having Yes Man in your group. If you're rolling with a group, don't have Yes Man in your group. Because if you have Yes Man in your group, them shits are going to be your downfall. Straight up. But back to what I'm saying. Back to the reaction. Hey, I gotta say with Balma, if it wasn't for Balma putting it down on Vegeta like that, the world, Goku's world, technically even though Goku is not really from the planet Earth, but I'm just saying, planet Earth right there would have been blown the hell up if it wasn't for Boma putting it down. So really, you got to put it, shout out to Boma because she 
technically saved the world. <laughs> In the world. <laughs> JP. Hey, shout out to Hastic, man. Keep doing what you're doing, guys. But now to end up the music mayhem, we got the all set. We on the set. Rumble World, Jamar Rose, Godzi, Peach King, Harry up front. Big. Sorry, y'all, I thought someone was on my foot, but let's get it. I'm just saying, with a title like we on the set, it about to get litty. From that Black Diamonds, of course. Let's get it. Hey. hey. What I told you. Because you need to tell me if you got a song that has the title called We On the Set, you expect it to be some, like some, in a way you can say club, nah, uh uh. Where a song that's called We On the Set is about to be pure ignorance and I, and I whip it. So let's get it. I'm on the set. 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 I'm on
they get banned. I'll let it rain like Exodia. Goes these holes like a bullet. I'm gonna go with you. He's up above. He's a holy one. Yeah, these bullets like stairs. The way they make your brain open up. Anybody can get it. Fish on the light skin opera. This nigga said, I'm the light skin opera. Saying, you get another one. You get another one. You get another one. Nah, nigga, what you mean? Yeah, these bullets like stairs. The way they make your brain open up. Anybody can get it. Fish on the light skin opera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big body pins in a big body talk. I can guarantee you in this yo hold up yeah this is why I have to drink water y'all that's why I gotta drink water because nigga I'll be telling y'all y'all think I'm lying Make me be in one of them shows and see what happens. Maybe go to one of their shows, right? See what happens. I'm gonna the way how y'all hear me talking now, right? I'm talking like this now, right? By the end of when I try to come home and I try to do other reactions, my voice is gonna be like this. <laughs> my voice is gonna be gone. I'm on the set. We on the set. I'm 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 on the I said this the last time with otaku on the world they're like the littest right where it's latest and sauciness right but i think i want to readjust well in a way they have their ways of doing it but i'm just saying all right here's what i'm gonna say otaku on the world is like the the littest when it comes to like getting saucy getting in a, any zone right but Rumble World, bro, they got that energy. Don't get it twisted. Otaku in the world can get it too, but I'm just saying, there's a different type of energy where if you ain't sweating in the middle of the song, then something is wrong with you. Because especially, and I'm already sweating as it is, right? Because like I said, with the fan, I needed y'all to hear. Me. But with but with this song, I'm telling y'all, make me be at one of these shows. I'm gonna be, I'm already, I'm black as it is, but let me go to one of their clothes. I'm gonna be freaking drowned. I'm, I'm gonna be feeling like I was in the freaking ocean <laughs> with sweat all over my body, straight up. They just got that type of energy. <laughs> I'm on the set. We're on the set. I'm on the set. We're on the set. I'm on the set. I'm on the set. We're 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 on the set. We're on the set. We're on the set. I'm sweating. <laughs> they made me sweat as a bitch in here. <laughs> and like I said, I'm already sweating as it is, right? But god damn it, they made me sweat, sweat in here. Y'all may not seen it, right? 
Y'all probably do see it. Hold on, let me see if I can get closer. Like, look at this, y'all. Y'all not seeing it right, but I'm telling y'all, I'm sweating. I, I'm just saying, with freaking Rumble World, they got that freaking mush. I'm going to say it like this. Rumble World got that mosh pit energy. They do. Especially when they have songs like these. Where, nigga, one way, with songs like this, you're gonna get punched. I don't know why. Songs like Me on the Set, nigga, you're gonna get punched. That should, that's gonna be like a warning where, nigga, if you come in, if you're listening to this song and if you're reacting it with a friend of yours, Please be cautioned. You're gonna get punched one way or another, and it's not gonna be, and it's gonna, and it's gonna be on accident. Just know that. But hey, man, if you made it this far in music, freaking mayhem, comment down. We on the set, <laughs> cause nigga, goddamn. But hey, man, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this music mayhem in the comments down below. Hope y'all liked the first episode of it because I got to say, I kind of like doing this because that way, in a way, it's like, like I said before in the first episode, if you haven't, go check it out. I said before, like with this, it's going to kind of be like the same thing like Anime Wednesdays, but the only difference is it's going to be like a mixture of when, mixture of little animes here and there, like a few little animes, well, mostly anime. But if anyhow, when they have like a music video and so and so, I'm going to add it in there. So who knows? Maybe it could have like, like I said, five or six songs or hell, eight songs for that matter. But hey, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this in the comments below. It's been your boy, Homo Ziggy, signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Let's go.